no OLEC Nestra Mini 2 SDR and DVBT USB stick, RTL2832 plus R820T2, with antenna and remote control. Contains RTL2832U interface IC and the Nook improved R820T2 tuner. This tuner has improved sensitivity and SNR compared to devices using the R820T. Unmatched price performance. Contains all the same improvements on the generic design as were made on the popular and well-tested Nestraminic including higher accuracy clock C low ESR capacitors high Q inductors and more. One year warranty direct from no OLEC. With locations in both the US and Canada and full technical support services your investment is a safe and wise one. Frequency capability is approximately 24 MHz 1750 MHz C with no gaps within that range. Expansion to HFC all the way down to 100 KHz C is available with the HAM it up up converter, sold separately. Free high quality telescopic antenna much improved over the older thin whip style antenna. Turn on tune in A and D. Listen. See more product details. Say hello to the newest member of NoOLX popular Nestor SDR range at the Nestor Mini 2. The Mini 2 uses a brand new tuner ICC the R820T2 made by Rafael Microc to provide increased sensitivity and improved SNR. A greatly improved telescopic metal antenna is also included with your SDR set at no extra charge. If you like the Nestor Minic you will love the Nestor Mini 2. The perfect device for learning software defined Radioc on the cheap. Amateur Radioc adds BC police and fire scanning trunking satellite images you name ITC this little guy can probably do it. Outperforms many devices 10x its cost. This custom no OLEC SDR is a modified DVBT USB dongle tuned for SDR usage including upgraded Kreistalk capacitors and inductors compared to generic devices. Full compatibility with a large array of software packages such as MATLABC HDSDRC SDR, C, SDR Touch C SDR Number C Plane Plotter Too many to list. MathWorks and Nulectm have coordinated to bring MATLAB support for our SDR receivers. The RTL SDR radio support package enables you to design wireless receivers using real-world signals. Using Communications System Toolbox TM in conjunction with an RTL SDR USB radio you can design and prototype systems that process real-time wireless signals in MATLAB and Simulink these units are based on the R820T2 tuner IC made by Rafael Micro. As such see they have a frequency capability of approximately 25 MHz 1750 MHz. There is also an RTL2832 UIC on board of Corsac which acts as the demodulator and USB interface. Interested in frequencies below 25 MHz we recommend you take a look at our HAM it up up converter which will let you listen all the way down to 100 kHz or lower with impeccable sensitivity. The connector type on the SDR in female MCXC and on the antenna male MCX. There are plenty of adapter and adapter cables available in our store if you want to connect your favorite antenna. device comes in a plastic bag with no documentation and no software. 
I had to search the internet until I found www.rtl-sdr.com slash rtl-sdr-quick-start-guide This answered all my questions and got me up and running. The www.newelec.com website has links to SDR number and HDSDR software for Windows. Both are fantastic programs for listening to various types of signals from 25 MHz up to 1750 MHz BRIVE been listening to CB Radio FM broadcasts Kfirek Polisek Airlines going overhead and the 2 meter and 440 MHz ham bands. Interesting think when I listen to the ham bands on a regular short wave ek I hear the signal about 1 or 2 seconds before I hear it on the RTL SDR receiver. Must be some kind of lag as the computer processes everything. If you have a Mac the software works fine under parallels however there is a free Mac software for it called GQRX. It works but is very limited. My favorite is SDR Radio V2 I asked tech support at Noelec about the remote control that comes in the package, it's not for any of the SDR apps it's for DVB video which is a TV format that's not transmitted here in the US. If you're in Europe here's the link to the software http colon slash slash f dot new elec dot com slash tv two eight tv two dot iso here's some software tips in case you get these errors program name sdr radio brer was cannot gain exclusive access to the selected radio solution turned out that in windows task manager can occurrence of sdr console was hiding out that didn't close when the rest of the program closed program name hdsdr brer was a device id has been used that is out of range for your system solution turned out that the program had forgotten the sound card it was to use RX input from radio and RX output to speaker should have been parallels microphone and parallels speaker but the program forgot program name SDR sharp Brer was one compatible devices has been found but are all busy solution once I got those others going this one was back to normal